So this is a nice surprise. I just woke up in the middle of the night and my tablet is in the recovery environment again. And it hasn't done this in a couple months, but it did it a couple times and it seems to always do it when it's charging in sleep mode. But this time it was just charging overnight. I fell asleep while a video was playing and I woke up to this. Now, I saw this earlier, but I was too, like, tired to actually record this. So, like, I fell back asleep, so it just stayed on screen. Um, but in this video, guys, I will be clicking, um, something. Um, I don't- I don't know if it's gonna do it, but it most likely will. But, I have an option that's just blank in the- in a boot entry. Um, because it did that, and if it does it again, I wanna click it because I want to see what it does, and I don't know when it's going to do this again, so like, I want to do it now, so that way, you know, because I don't know when this is going to actually happen again, so if it's there, I'm going to click it, and if it's not there, then rip. But I only saw it there once, even though this happened twice, because the first time it happened, I didn't even click the use another OS option. Um. So, if this bricks something, or if this does something bad, this is like being documented right now. So, this is on my surface, and let's see, is there a mouse? Yeah. There's a mouse, okay. So, choose your keyboard layout. What? Like, what's it mean, like, choose your keyboard layout for what? Like, why is it going in recovery? This is so weird. This is like so strange. I don't get this. Okay, there is a use another operating system option. Um, before I go in there, if I go to like troubleshoot, advanced, um, you can see some advanced options in here. And by looking at these, these do not look like RS5 or 19H1 options. So my guess is it's using the RS4 uh, recovery environment because that's what this tablet came with. So most likely that's what it's using at the moment. Um, I'm gonna go back. Um, see, I could exit to continue to Windows 10, but that'll just reboot it and it will boot because I did that twice. Um, the last two times I did it, which once I did it in the middle of the night, like this time. Um, and then I did it during the day once, but this time I did it again in the middle of the night, which makes no sense. Um, so use another OS most likely is gonna show the, um, Windows 10 or blank. Um, I only saw it once, because the first time I never even clicked this option, but if it shows it again, I am going to click blank. This is documented. So if something happens, if something bricks, um, if it shows it, which I actually really hope it does, we are clicking it. So... Oh, it's there! Windows 10 or blank! Oh, boy. So, basically, there is a blank boot entry. Again. I don't know where this came from. Um, this is really weird. I don't know what it's gonna do. This is really interesting because, I don't know, it just seems really interesting. So, I want you guys to pause the video, place your bets in the comments of what you think it's going to do. I personally think it's just going to show an error, and it's not going to do anything. Um, like, it's probably just going to show a boot error, because I don't think that entry is actually valid. Um, if it does anything else, I would be shocked. Um, but, we're going to find out, guys, what that does, once and for all, and we're going to end this. And we're just gonna know. It's like, basically, you you don't know till you click it. Just like with this recent um, ISO challenge in a couple days, I won't know what OS I get until I install it and see what it is. So with the almost the same with this boot entry, you don't know what this entry does until you click it, and it's mysterious because there's no name. It's just, oh hi there, I'm blank. Um, nice to meet you. Okay, so, 
Are you guys ready for me to click it to see what happens? Most likely, it's it's either going to be a recovery option, um, it's either going to be a just a dead entry and just simply say, oh, your PC needs to be repaired, blah blah blah, and then you'll just get out of it and it'll boot. Or, um, what was I going to say? Or maybe it'll be SOD. Um, I doubt it's gonna actually load. Um, it may just load the normal operating system. <sighs> I really hope this doesn't do anything bad. Like, I just- I just cross my fingers that this doesn't brick the OS. Because if it does, I have to reinstall. But because of the recent challenge coming up anyways... Um, I might have to anyways, since I'm going on vacation. Okay, I'm just stalling myself because I'm like really scared to click it. But are you guys ready once and for all? And I'm sorry this video was so long. I just wanted to like explain. Um, if any of you guys know why my tablet is doing this, um, leave a comment. Because I don't understand why it's showing this blank boot option. Okay, guys, I'm gonna click it. I'm gonna risk it. It's probably gonna do something bad. <laughs> it's probably gonna- I hope it doesn't brick it. I really hope it just shows an error. To be honest. That's what I want it to do. But I hope it has no effect in the OS. Um, because the first time it did this, I saw you use another OS, but never clicked it, because I was scared. The second time I saw it there, but I was too scared to click it, and then I regretted not clicking it, because I wanted to see what it did, and when I went back in recovery manually, it was gone. And this is the third time. Third time's a charm. I gotta know what this is. This is May 30th. Um, the last time I did it was, like, March. I don't know. Alright, are you guys ready? Five, four, three, two... One. I, I did it. I did it. Oh god, I did it. Oh god, I did it. This is documented. Please don't do anything. Please don't do anything. What's it doing? It's booting? It's booting? What? So much for a blank boot entry. It looks like just booting in Windows. Yeah, it just booted in Windows. Sorry, something went wrong. Please sign in with your PIN. Okay. What? It, it just booted normally. What? What? What the crap? Okay. Okay, what the crap? Um, let's go to like... M... S config. What the? What? Okay, okay, okay. What the crap? There's only one entry. Guys, my tablet is drunk. Um, even the brightness was all the way down, and I just had to bring in the brightness up because I was, I was watching that video. Yeah, what? Okay, so everything looks fine? Why is this PC not opening? Oh, it did open. Okay, good. Okay. Is there any event logs? This is so weird. Okay. So the blank boot entry didn't brick it, but it didn't do anything. It did nothing, which makes no sense. Let's see when the device shut off or crashed or like, I wanna see if it crashed. I feel like the device crashed or something. So I'm just going to push the arrow key. I'm gonna tap on the top one. I'm gonna move it down. What is this? I don't know. The TPM is successful provisions and is now ready to use. I don't know if that's normal, but... What the heck does that mean? I think that's normal for boot up. What? Reset policy scheme. 
I don't know what that is. But that was at four in the morning, which is like now. Same with this one. Uh, can't find one. I just thought I'd show you guys. What? I don't even know if any of this is normal. The driver failed to start. That's bad. Um. I still want to know what did this. It freaked me out. Just waking up in the middle of the night and seeing that scared the living crap out of me. Even though I kind of wanted it to happen again so I can see what was causing it. It seems like at 12.40 a.m. is when it did it. But why? The service has stopped. Shutdown flag value is one. It's waiting on this to stop. It received shutdown notification. It received terminate event the stop the log service the service terminated unexpectedly for um, VMware what is this the process windows BT services does initiate the restart computer Catholic. what the crap did it try doing a feature update wait a stinking Wait a second. That was a that was a month ago. Okay, that's kind of weird because what upgrade? What upgrade? Well, look up that reason code. I've never seen this before. In fact, the last time it did this, this was never in Event Viewer. So. I am not even sure, because it did this a couple times and that never showed. And then this is just filled with a ton of nonsense. So it looks like it tried to upgrade something and then it just flipped out. Well, I don't know what it was upgrading, but, but whatever it was upgrading didn't work. Um, I find that very interesting. Um, I might make a part two to this video of figuring out what it was doing, but Windows Update says it didn't do anything, so I find that kind of weird. Like, shouldn't this, like, okay, this has got to be, hmm, because the last time... The last time this happened... But for all this crap is... Um... So... I don't know... It says log stopped and it, it says VMware terminated, but right before that it has this win login saying it initiated restart, or whatever, um, of the computer. And I don't even know if that's what did it, but why it says OS upgrade, I, I, I don't know, because there was no OS upgrade. Um, see, there's this upgrade, this is an upgrade right here, but that was a month ago. That's nothing recent. So unless it was trying to, like, do some insider build behind my back and didn't tell me, um... Which is maybe possible, maybe it's a glitch. But the weird thing is, is that says you're up to date, last check yesterday. So maybe it did check yesterday and tried and then didn't show an update history. I am on Insider, but I'm on Release Preview. So like, 
my my guess here is it's got to be something to do with Insider downloading that new preview build that came out today, maybe. But then again, I've had the same issue a couple times, but that was never shown in the logs. So I don't know if that was the case the last two times it did this, or if that was another cause, but this is bizarre. Like, this is really weird. Please leave your comments down below. I'll probably stop the video here. Um, I might update the, the description if I have any more information. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you guys are having a good day. I can't believe I'm doing this at 4 a.m. Like, jeez. I can't believe I'm looking at this at 4 a.m. This is kind of weird, but... I, I don't even know. Like, I woke up in the middle of the night at, like... One, it didn't do anything because I just was like, I'm not dealing with this right now. I want to sleep. And then I woke up at four and it was still there. And I was like, okay, time to look at this. I don't want to leave this on all night. And then I started seeing it in my dreams. So I was like, okay, I need to look. I need to figure out what this blank option is. And apparently it's nothing. So, all right. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I don't know what caused that, but... Maybe insider glitch or I, I really don't even know. Really bizarre. Alright, thanks for watching guys. Leave your suggestions in the comments and bye-bye for now.